I'm looking at some of the flotsam here. The flotsam will show us exactly what the submergent communities are made of. Uh, you can see this, this particular, this particular aquatic plant is called coontail. It grows prodigiously here in the um, shallows of Lake Tarpon. So we have the photic zone, the photic zone, which uh, sunlight reaches the bottom. The difference between a lake and a pond is the uh, lakes are deep enough to have dark areas called the profundal zone. But we're at the, the photic zone here and uh, we have a lot of that coontail growing and a lot of eelgrass communities. Eelgrass is this. This is a piece of eelgrass, eelgrass communities. Uh, so our submergent vegetation in this Lake Tarpon area in the aphotic zone uh, appears to be mostly coontail and eelgrass communities. Now that is great forage for the uh, fish, uh, a lot of place to hide out. Uh, the uh, shell crackers, the red ear sunfish eat the snails that live in the uh, community and of course up the food chain the bass would be the top freshwater uh, fish that uh, lives in this particular lake.